Hi guys, Matt from Fanatics here. Got another order to unbox for you guys today. Let's see what we got going. I know we've got uh, another round of restock. I went out and found some cool stuff and filled in some holes. So let's see what we got. First thing out of the bag, I got platinum hatchets. We we're down to just a couple. I like to always have a good stock on these guys. So super cool top fish that are on the Tetra special. Remember, we have moving specials going on, including our uh, Tetras. Those are uh, buy four and get, or four or more, and get 25% off. Uh, let's see, next thing we got is a mono shrimp. Nice size on these guys today. Mono shrimp, of course, are an absolute necessity for your planted tank. Those look great. And next thing up, we have gold rams. Had some of these on last order. I had those big ones. So those guys sold out in a day. So we got in another batch. These are just the standard size guys. Uh, look real nice. Gotta love the rams. thing in this box. Oh, these are cardinals. Looked kind of washed out in the bag. I had to look at them twice, but these are cardinal tetras. Again, the tetra spe uh, specials going on by four or more get 25% off. That's why we've been going through so many cardinals. And I'm pretty sure that's everything we got for this box today. Uh, let's get on to the next one. All right, here we go with our next box. Wednesday, so it's been so long since I ordered on Monday that I'm having a hard time remembering what I ordered. You guys will probably draw, see this on Monday, so it'll be a couple more days. Oh, we got super red bushy nose plecos. Look good, nice bright red on those guys. Uh, bright orange, anyway. That's what a super red's going to look like when they're little. They get more orange, more red as they get bigger. Decent size on those. You gotta love super red bushies. Up we have cherry barbs. Nice batch of cherry barbs. Sold out of those last week as well. Those guys are on the special. Remember, all the barbs are on special. Uh, buy four or more, get 25% off. Right up to the time we move. Oh, I love these guys. I haven't had them in for a while. These are uh, Hecalize or uh, Thread Friendly Cars. Some people put them in with the Earth Eaters. Some people put them with the Akaras. Either way, uh, fairly mellow, medium-sized cichlid. Oh, I love these guys, too. <laughs> Apparently, I love a lot of fish. Uh, these are checkerboard cichlids. Remember, last week we had some checkerboard cichlids, and I looked a little bit confused. Uh, it turned out I got a little bit unusual variety of checkerboard cichlid last week. Uh, these are the more standard ones. Uh, at some point, I want to do a breakout on the difference between the different species of those guys because I find that kind of cool. Uh, another thing that uh, got me confused last week, too. So these are reticulated cories, or Corydoris reticulatus, or sometimes they're called Sodalis. I got all confused when I pulled out Corydoris trilineatus because I wasn't specific enough with my wholesaler. They sent me the trailer and the oddest last week. And this week we got the ones I expected. Uh, let's see. Simphilum Veja. Veja Simphilum. These are the red-headed cichlids. Large, colorful, aggressive South, well, Central American cichlids. Super cool guys. Of course, babies like that. Take a while to grow them out, but they're inexpensive at that size. And, oh, I love them. This is an L260. That's a... Uh, Queen Arabesque Pleco. We had one. Went through that guy. Just got another one in. We almost try to always have at least one of those guys in stock. Uh, next up we have Festivums. These are actually, somebody ordered, special ordered some of these guys. Nice size on them. He was concerned about what size they come in. These guys are pretty mellow South American cichlid. Actually, they're I think they're distantly related to an angel. At least they act in the tank a lot like an angelfish. Kind of mellow, 
not as aggressive as some of your bigger guys. Here we have some Koi Angels. Maybe a little extra on these guys. They'll go in as a medium. They're not particularly tiny, but they'll be at the medium price. They're not, not the largest of mediums, but good looking fish for the price. And that's it for this box. Alrighty, here's the last box I have on this order. We got another little order coming in tomorrow, I believe. And of course, whatever else I can find locally, I'll add to the back of the video, like I do every week. Right, let's take a look and see what we got that's fun. First thing is some frogs. African dwarf frogs. Somebody asked me if I could get blondes. I haven't found them yet, but we're looking. We got the regular dwarf frogs in this week, though. Next thing up, we have, oh, another L273. It's a Titanic Pleco. They didn't have them listed on a color. They come in the reds, the yellows. I've seen them list them as a black before. I think there's a possibility that that could be a female because the color variety really matters a lot on a male to female on those, but I wouldn't stake any reputation on it. That's a cool Pleco, regardless. Super cool pseudocanthus. Uh, next out of the bag, I've got Honey Dwarf Grommies. That's a restock on these guys. They really colored up amazingly uh, in the tank last time. Yeah, these don't look like the sunsets. I think maybe I just got the honey dwarfs. I didn't get the sunsets. Well, I had man meant to get the sunsets, but either way, if those are the regulars, they got good color. Uh, Corydoras Aeneas. These are your standard Aenea Corys or green Corys. Oftentimes can get those locally, but I haven't been able to pick them up for a while, so happy to be able to offer those guys. An expensive, great Cory. Yo-yo loaches. These are pretty big yo-yo loaches, actually. Kind of gold color to them, too, for the yo-yo. I almost wonder if they sent me the golden uh, striped loach like we ordered a couple weeks ago. Uh, next thing out, we have Raspora rubicens. These are the cardinal rasporas. It's actually a new fish for me. I have not actually had those here in the store. I've thought about bringing them in a time or two, but we've been so full all the time that I just didn't get around to it. So today we have them, a new Respora for us. Uh, this is a, a Galaxy Candy Koi Betta. Super cool, high-end Betta. You look pretty neat in the bag. We'll see what he looks like in a tank. You can sit up here a little bit. Uh, blue Rams. We ran out of those guys last week as well. So I went ahead and bought a whole nother batch of Blue Rams. Looking good. And ran out of these this week as well. These are Roseline Sharks. I would have bought a small batch of them and then somebody come and bought what I have left so I would have doubled that batch if I had known that. But at least we'll have something for the week. We'll get more soon. And here's something else I haven't had in a really long time. These are Texas cichlids. Obviously, North American or Central American cichlid. With the name Texas cichlid, of course. Uh, big, aggressive fish. These aren't like the red Texas. This is your standard Texas cichlid. Get huge. We had one here that was ooh, 14, 15 inches and about 8 inches tall. Super cool fish when they get big. Lots of personality. That's it for this little order, guys. All right, I got another little order in today. It'll look like one order to you guys, but to me, it's two orders separated by a few hours. I'm really excited here because, yes, we got black worms in. Two pounds of black worms. I haven't been able to get these for like three or four weeks. Uh, any of you guys been looking for it, we do have them. We're going to limit people to uh, just two ounces per customer for the next week and then after the first week if uh, anybody who needs a bigger quantity is welcome to take whatever we have. Uh, second thing we got here is uh, feeder goldfish. Some of those feeder goldfish do not look like they made the trip very well. Uh, feeder goldfish for you. But anyway, that's uh, box number one. Feeders. We got feeder goldfish and black worms. Yummy on toast, I say. 
Alrighty, this box should be more fun. Well, I was really happy about the theaters, but this will be more exciting to watch. First bag out of the box is... Longfin Serpe Tetris. Somebody bought me out of those last week, so we got a new batch of Longfin Serpes. They'll be on the, the Tetris special. So buy four or more and get a 25% discount. We have shrimp. Wow, I was looking for black crystals, but these don't look like black crystals. These look like black neo, so I have to double check with the supplier, make sure their black crystals didn't came in without any stripes this time, which would be really weird. Uh, here we have red crystals. These look like they should and actually came in on the small side, but look healthy. All of them spinning around. Nice stripes on those guys. A little bit of variety in pattern. Really enjoy the bee shrimp, but uh, remember those are a little more specific on the water parameters than your neos. Next out we have, oh, they're tiny, tiny. Oh my gosh, they are tiny. These are panda loaches. I, I have never seen panda loaches this small. Super cool hillstream loach. They get up to about two and a half, maybe three inches. I've gotten them in small, maybe twice this size, three times this size before, but some of these guys are just fry. Super cool little fish, though. Great pattern. They actually lose the bright stripes as they get older, so they'll retain pattern a lot longer because they're so tiny. Thing up, we have some more shrimp. These are orange shrimp. Got a big batch last week, and uh, most of those were on special order, so I went ahead and picked up another batch this week. We have fry in our, or I guess it'd be shrimplets in our orange shrimp tank right now, but they won't be big enough for a while. And then got a nice big batch of diamond tetras. Haven't had those in a while. Actually, we had some right at the beginning of lockdown, uh, sold out. The last couple in our special, the first like hour of our Tetra special, so I brought in some more, and they're still on special. That would be the buy four or more and get 25% off. And a restock on Glowfish. These guys have been kind of flying out of here this week or last week, so we brought in some more uh, Glow Tetras, variety of different colors. And that's everything for this order and everything for this week. We'll have some more uh, local bread and other things to spotlight for you here in a second. And that's it for the ship. We got in Santa Claus guppies last week. I forgot to get them on the video. These guys are $15 a pair. Super nice fish. They're local bread. Really nice. Look at the females, the big tails on those females always come in on kind of a yellow. And then the males, of course, are the red tail with the red top and then the white uh, dumbos. Super neat pair, $15 a pair. What we have for this week's video, guys, I did want to take a second and plug to try to sell off the last bit of pond fish we have. I still have this one big koi, he's nine inches and just 20 bucks. So if you got a spot for that guy, Come and get them. Also got a group of larger comets. Uh, I wouldn't mind moving out before we close down the ponds. Uh, guys, thanks so much for taking the time to check out our video once again. We'll be back again soon with more updates on what's going on with moving and what new fish we have in store for you.